Yo, welcome everybody. Today we're continuing on with Silent Hill 4, The Room. We're thinking that we're going to finish this today. And, um, shouldn't be a problem. Let me see if I got this straight. Yeah, it was slipping a little bit because of my headphones, or my, you know, my headphones, yeah. But, um, yeah, we're going to try to finish this game today. And after we finish this game, we're going to continue on to uh, Resident Evil 4. But, uh, yeah, let's jump into this. And for all that's new and everybody that doesn't know me, happy Veterans Day. I'm a veteran of the Marine Corps, obviously. So let's jump into Silent Hill 4 and wrap this up. It's going to capture. There we go. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about all this nonsense in here. Be quick to react on it and suck my health out as soon as I start. <clears throat> my webcam doesn't seem like it's really clear. So we rescued her, and we got to take it back to the other side. Apparently she can't go down. Um, she can't go down ladders. a dead end up the stairs. Alright, let's see where we're at on the entrance. Alright, we need to get to the right side. And I think it's going to loop us all the way down to the top right. There's a bit of a maze when you're doing this. I don't think you can just walk over and be there. <gasps> She's always in the way. She too far behind? Nah, she's good. I guess that means we're going the right way if that starts happening. As long as we're finding paths and doors that work, we're going the right way. What is she doing? Yeah, let's go. I'm like eerily close to it. I think I just led us to a trap. Okay. That's a definite. There it is. That's the way out. Curious whether or not I have to use the 
train handle here. Where was that? Right here? I'm not really sure where I have to use that. I can't interact with anything there, so I guess... Not yet. What I'm believing we gotta do is use both the tokens now, since we have both of them, to get to the other side of the murder scene. She's gonna stay and fight that thing. I knew it. There she goes. I guess we just go all the way back up. What does that say? Lynch Street exit. Go through there. Now we're capable of going back through here. With her. Don't know what kept her, but... I don't think there's anything left in here that I need. But yeah, I couldn't get to this part with her with me. So I'm wondering if there's something I need to do. King Street Line, maybe? It's not letting me walk, so I'm guessing this is the right way. Oh, okay, here we go. I knew this was coming. I'm gonna do my best to protect her. Pretty sure that she can get killed. We're just floating along. He's gone. <laughs> That's the longest escalator in the world. Guessing we're almost there. I have to be almost there. Wow, this is taking a while. Okay, let's just chance it. I knew that was coming. So I saved her. <laughs> Don't want her getting smacked around. Come on. I 
I just gotta solve this mystery where this uh, handle goes. I have no clue. May have to check it out because I have no idea where it could be. Yeah, let me check that out because I don't want to be running around in circles. Uh, what is it? Uh, What do you use? Train handle? Yeah, like once in a blue moon I'll get stuck in one of these things and have to wander around for 15 minutes try to figure out where to go. It doesn't really give you the full... It, it explains up to the point to where, of all the stuff I've done, then it makes you click on the link for the final, you know, answer. Um, you want to get your... Blah, blah, blah. Filthy coin, holy candle, done all that. Murder scene key. We've done that. Yeah, we've done all this. All right, here's the train handle. Side room now. <clears throat> Head. Excuse me. <clears throat> okay. Now. Head through the turnstile after using the commuter ticket. And let's street line coin and walk back to Eileen. We did that. Have to retrace your steps. We did all of this. Down the escalators via the turnstiles. Go down the escalator with Eileen in hand. The main problem with this is that the wall men, blah, blah, blah. We've done that. With the second escalator audio out of the way, hop into the train car. Collect the nine iron from one of the seats along the... The pesky ghosts. Uh huh. I guess I'm I'm not really stuck. I thought I was stuck, but I'm not. I've pretty much done everything I'm supposed to do up to this point. I was supposed to bring her back down the escalator. And now I'm supposed to find the train to use this train handle on down in this King's area. I just doubt myself too much. I'm guessing this is the train. Come on, girl. Don't don't hang out with him. I'll have to come back for her. Actually, not. She gonna run up here? No, that's one of those things. Car moved about one car length.
yeah, we didn't get stuck at all. Hmm. Another sort of obedience in case I want to use it on one of those things. Take this opportunity to get a drink. All right, this. Reason why he uh, came running in here at me? <laughs> Come on, nothing wrong with you. Just getting all worried, like there's something about to jump at her. I see a bunch of what looks like body parts and stuff, but nothing that looks like it's going to come at us yet. Oh yeah, I remember this. This looks familiar. screaming and there's a ghost child in the closet and the windows rattling clock going crazy we're getting there though hope everybody's having a good day it uh, feels like we're getting close to finishing this All they said was to go deep. I remember that part. And that was from last stream, just to keep on continuing deeper and deeper. If I actually have to fight this guy, it's unlocked. Oh, yeah. I guess we're not close to beating it. I thought I remember this. This is the orphanage part. Oh no! Yeah, these are just gonna keep on spawning, and I gotta find a way out. Um, waste of our time. She didn't come with. Where's she at? Oh, she's still playing games with him.
There we go. Got her close enough so she'll follow. Health drink. Oh, let's just replace it because I need some health anyway. If I should mess with those dogs or not. Screw it, let's have some fun. I was hoping she'd help. There we go. She's trying to help. Oh, come here, girl. I need some help. The shrieking. Oh. oh yeah. The Hallam. Orphanage burned down. Yikes. That's a stream. There's a net on the ground. Something's here, but nothing's here. I feel something from the well. Something's missing. Ah, it has begun. Jasper. There's a burnt body up there in a the wheelchair. I don't think I... Can I? Yes, I can. A charred doll's body is sitting in the wheelchair. There's a message carved into it. Though my body be destroyed, I will not let you pass here. To prepare for the receiver of wisdom, <clears throat> I cut my body into five pieces and hid them in the darkness. Okay. When my body is once again whole, the path to below will be opened. If you are the receiver of wisdom, you will understand my words. The ritual has begun. Alright, so I guess I have to find the pieces of his body just laying around in random places. Oh, that's a holy candle. I have no room for it. Oh, man. I've already got all this stuff unlocked, so I'm not going to know which way to go to backtrack or anything. I guess the light gray stuff is the stuff I haven't been to. So which way should I explore first? No reason to save it. Let's go to the right first. I think that's the way I explored first the first time. Did she come with? Ah, oh, she did. Hmm. I don't know what's going on with her. Yeah, I figure she's gonna fight him. What's this? Oh, that's another health drink. She worried about. 
All I know, this guy started shooting at me. Then he started revving up a chainsaw. I guess he's done. He had enough. Oh yeah, all the kid riding. I should have probably put all those coin passes away. I can read this writing. Really? It looks like some kind of a diary. Here goes. October 17th. The important lady told me my mother was asleep in Ashfield. I have a mother too. I'm so happy. I want to see my mother. Where is Ashfield anyway? Could this be... Silent Hill Woods? Huh. So she can read the graffiti. That's cool. I need to put the uh, last stage's uh, keys away because they're just throwing up inventory. Especially if I'm going to have to pick up uh, five uh, pieces to that charred doll. <clears throat> Excuse me. Put this away, that away. Oh. I don't know if I'll need that. Not for a while, at least. I never really use them anyway. They're not. Whoa. That's fun. That's the first time I actually noticed that where that uh, sound was coming from on, on the wall was those kids on top of my chest. That's insane. Oh, there's a diary over here. There's a red paper stuck in here. My theory is that Walter never died at the prison. It may have been someone else who committed suicide. Either that or the person the police arrested was not the real Walter Sullivan. I'm in no position to investigate what really happened at the prison, but in any case, Walter didn't die at the prison. The man with the coat that showed up here was the real Walter. Seven years ago, he did something in that apartment. I'm certain here's a link between that and the bizarre things that have been happening here. Just a little bit more and I'll have this whole thing figured out. I may even find that the real Walter is somewhere nearby. So, Walter Sullivan is a guy I've been getting into fights with. Chasing me around because I rescued his uh, 20th victim. I was hoping maybe there was something back here. I mean, there's five pieces to find. I would assume there would be one of them be back here. That sucks. This is Holy Flame. Keep all the ghosts out. What's this? Silver bullets. Special bullets. Effective against ghosts. Small diameter. Best used with the pistol. Well, that's cool. Oh, 
I'll take advantage of that. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. He's still alive? Getting better at that. Man, you can't kill that guy. Wish I can get his gun and, uh, Chainsaw, that'd be cool. Oh. Oh, she ain't gonna be able to read that. Not with them chasing her. Maybe there would be like a piece around this way. Guess not. Oh no, Walter didn't like me going the right side. I'm going the left side now. See if he shows up over here. Alright, put him down twice. That's a trap, I remember that. Never killed me though. Somehow I was fast enough on reaction to get away from it. That's all I wanted to do. I wanted to shoot him with the silver bullet so he go down. And it worked. Thick rock is creepy somehow. Doesn't say it's worth anything though. Oh no! I didn't mean to do that. I was about to say. Hopefully he doesn't come back to life, because... <gasps> How about if I leave the room and then come back through, he'll come back to life, because I did that. Yeah, I didn't mean to... Let me guess, she didn't come, did she? She always gets just a little bit too far behind. check this out it's been a while since I came to here to Silent Hill maybe I'll meet the devil listen to that I've already read this 
All right, come on. I don't want to leave you behind. Is there two ways in here? No, just the one. Taking a little quick look around. Ooh. Don't see anything to pick up. Guess we're going up here. That's just gonna be a pain right there. She's just gonna have to beat on him, I guess. Just the way it's going to be, because I'm going to have to go through this and then come back for her if she don't follow. Ah, I was just shocked she actually followed. Oh, wow. That guy doesn't like to go down too easily. So I'm hoping maybe she'll run past him so we can leave. Come on. Wow, there's, there's another one. Come on. I want you dying. I guess I gotta leave her and come back. Oh. There we go. She was just barely out of line. There shouldn't be anything in this area that to attack me because there's like the holy fires that was there. Oh yeah, these guys. Can't read it. October 6th. Tomorrow is book study in the chapel. If I can't read well, I'll wind up like John. I'm really scared. I'm pretty sure that somewhere in these woods is an orphanage called Wish House. Yeah. It's burned down, it looked like. Here goes. October 5th. I got hit again. I didn't do anything wrong. I wish he was dead. That was kind of short. How about this one. Here goes. October 4th. My cheek hurts. I hate him. Okay, let's go. Here's the well they were talking about. At least they were talking about a well. Maybe I need to put a holy candle next to the well. I can't put it here. Hmm. This is the very end of the area. I haven't seen one single thing to do this with. What else do they want me to do with her?
Yeah, I see way back here. What was this going to do for me? Probably another diary page or something in the door. Hopefully, give me a clue to what I'm supposed to go go do next for this. Because the woods is just like a two pronged fork. There's not much to it. Equip it so it don't break. All kinds of crazy crap in it. Hmm. I'm glad there's nothing under the door. Let's continue on. Maybe we go back to the wish house with Eileen. She can figure out what we're supposed to do. Since she's so good at translating all these uh, graffiti marks. Yes, this one, this path is a little longer than the last one. It broke. All it really does is prevent them from attacking you. Makes your weapon a little stronger against those type of enemies, but other than that... Doesn't really do anything. Seems like the only way to put them down permanently is a silver bullet. I don't think she read this one. I don't think she will. She only read the ones on like the gravestones and stuff like that. I don't know why she wouldn't read that one. I guess. She was saying, I mean, I already know that there's a place we was already messing around with called Wish House, but I already tried going back there, and there was just a burnt body on an, a tore down house. Already checked it out. Too dark to see. <laughs> Doesn't surprise me that didn't work. Well, these things are always fun. Coming back from that weird little area that we went. Because we already circled around. Maybe it's just triggering events 
one by one is what's keeping us. Silent Hill Smile Support Society, what? Wish House. That's the orphanage run by the cult, huh? Yeah, this is the area. We've been here. Here goes. March 17th. I went to Ashfield again. It was my fourth time. Just like last time, my mother... Something... The city is scary and the apartment where my mother is has... Um... I can't read any more than that. Uh, it's just red markings on it. Okay, we're good there. Let's go over here. Here goes. October 18th. I have to stay in the round cell even if I read well tomorrow. If I do it, God will be happy. So I will do it. He comes into the round cell a lot to visit. But it's okay, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> I guess the only other way I haven't been is this door back here. Get her to catch up. All right, all right. Well, let's go. Okay, more of these guys. Here, another one. Thought I did. I, I studied archaeology back in college, but I... Is fun to kill. Doesn't seem like they're ever hard to kill. Too dark to see in here, too. That's the second well I found, and I remember reading about what the need for a well here. Okay, let's continue on. There must be like a specific well they're talking about. They're giving me health drinks everywhere. Body hanging from up there. Here's the lake. Revolver bullets. I've got the revolver sitting back in my chest. Or inventory box, whatever you want to call it. Will she not read that? I guess not. Toluca Lake. Are you Walter Sullivan? That's what everybody calls me, but I don't really have a name or a home either. Well, what about a mom or dad? Yeah, but I never met them. They left South Ashfield Heights right after I was born. But soon I'll get to see my mom. Do you know where she is now? Yeah, of course. 
right where I was born. Lots of people tried to stop me, but it's fine now. It says in the scriptures that I'll be with her. I gotta hurry. Mom's waiting. Some kind of suspicious looking medallion. Crest medallion. Medallion with a disturbing emblem carved into it. It's about 10 inches in diameter. Can't read that. Looks like we got the um, seal Metatron now. Now we just got to figure out where the hell to go with it. Hmm. Walter took off. Goes, October 21st. Sunday is the day I leave the round cell to read the book. I read very well today. If I can do a good job reading the 21 sacraments for the descent of the Holy Mother, I can meet my mother. The important lady told me that. But tomorrow I'm going to the round cell again. Oh, yeah. They picked up all the trouble now. Brought them all back. Had to wait them up a little bit. Didn't want her to get too far behind. Curious how much stuff spawned after triggering that, uh, Cutscene. <laughs> Yo, Dina Moore, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good night. We're hopefully uh, going to finish Silent Hill 4 tonight. That's the goal. And then after that, we'll uh, play Resident Evil 4. Just repping um, the Marine Corps for uh, Veterans Day. I thought that was some kind. Of, oh no, that's a lamp. Never mind. I don't have any of the piece. Oh, definitely. I don't see why not. Inventory is completely stacked full. <gasps> really got to figure out. Oh, what's this? Upgrade for her weapon? Light and Eileen only. Yep, that's what it is. An Eileen upgrade. Ha, huh, she's got a chain now. That's cool. Um, yeah, I gotta do some inventory management. There's an inventory box right here, so. Now that we triggered that event, we gotta figure out where the hell to go. Guess I'm not able to get the five uh, doll pieces until I triggered that or something. Got more than enough uh, heals. I never use my first aid kits anyway. 
Might as well put them away until I actually do get, run into a problem where I need them. They give me way too many uh, nutrition drinks anyway. Let's see here. Uh, this can go away. Don't need that. Save the revolver rounds for another time. Yeah, the seal. Really don't know what the seal's for. Definitely on a something like that. I'm definitely gonna keep on me though. Check the map. Um, let's go back this way. It says that there's a door at the beginning I haven't gone through yet. Actually, I'm not sure if I should go through that door or not. Get her to read this, if she will. Here goes. October 15th. Bob is gone. Nobody will tell me what happened. I bet... Uh, I can't read any more than that. Uh, that's all good. I just remember picking up a note or something saying... That we need to check out a well. I've seen two wells, and every single time I look into them, it says too dark to see. Here's a well. It's too dark to see as well. the graveyard yo chaos happy veterans day man thank you man I appreciate it we're going to attempt to finish uh, Silent Hill 4 today hopefully that way we can move on to Resident Evil 4 uh, I think this will take us back to the substation Yeah, I gotta figure out what they mean to find with all these uh, pieces of doll, or whatever. I can't continue on until I finish the doll, and I have no clue where it's at. See, I thought this was a uh, door right here, but I guess not. All right. Well, probably going to be one of those things where. You gotta look in just the most random places to find these doll pieces. Ah, she's messing an awful lot with that chain. Just swinging it around randomly. I figured it would be gotta lurk a bit while I shower and stuff. It's all good chaos. I'll see you in a bit.
Oh yeah, I don't know much about Veterans Game. Oh, it's all good. It's uh just celebrating um American uh veterans is all. It's every uh, November eleventh, the day after uh the birthday of the the Marine Corps birthday. Uh, thank you, Trinkington. I appreciate it. How are you doing tonight? Yo, King Satan, what's going on? See this, the carved message on his chest said that I needed five pieces to open up a path. And I haven't found one. They must be in the most random places. That's good, Cass. Or I mean, Trinkinson, sorry. Yeah, I was just talking to Chaos a second ago. <laughs> Where would these doll pieces be? It would either be that... You know what? I'm going to make sure I know what I'm doing. Let's look this up because I don't want to drag this out and bleed into another stream. This is the fourth stream into this game. Uh, trying to look for doll pieces in Silent Hill 4. Hmm. See, this is what I was, uh, this is, this is exactly what I, I thought was, it's, the, the signal is sucks here. Oh, that's, uh, no good, Gina. I'm just, I get, I get really bad, uh, signals well where I'm at. So I always have to constantly, um, reset everything and it drives me nuts. But yeah, this this is saying exactly what I thought that the me the message or the diary piece said that I have to find them in wells around the orphanage. And every time I go by one, it's too dark to see. Which means I'm not doing something right. I'm going to just ask how to see in Wells in Dark Souls. Or fuck, not Dark Souls. Silent Hill. Light your torch on the fire and go to the room where you will find a well. Search it for the doll's room. What torch? Was there a torch I was supposed to find that I never found? Yeah, this is getting stranger and stranger. Yes, uh, Silent Hill 4, where to find torch? Um, the torch is a weapon obtained from the lit brazier in the cemetery area during a second visit in the forest area. Okay. Alright, so it's not that big of a deal. I, uh, gotta go across. Yo, DeBronze, how you doing tonight? 
Thank you for stopping by. Nice to see you again. Hope you're having a good night. We're going to finish this game tonight. Did she come with? I hope she came with. Nope, she didn't. But yeah, I understand this puzzle now. Like the diary said, you had to find the doll pieces inside wells scattered across different areas in the forest. And I knew that. I just didn't know how to light them up to where I can see inside them. And now I do. Why didn't... What the hell? Why didn't she... I about to say, why isn't he going through there? I gotta go back to the cemetery. Because there's one of the whales right there. I gotta go back to the cemetery and there will be a torch I can pick up as a weapon. That torch is what's gonna help me see into those wells. These guys are annoying. All right, where's your torch at? That must be it. Something written on the candlestick. Holy flame. It's a torch. Take the torch. Yup. Equipical item. The tip can be lit on fire to lit up, to light up dark areas. Soak the torch in an oil to make it last even longer. Oh man. That figures. She helped me. You trying to get distance on me? What are you doing, buddy? I'm not gonna let you just get away with that. He thought he was just going to escape. I wouldn't let him get away with that. Oh, man. Okay. I think he learned his lesson that time. How do you light it? <laughs> I don't get how you light it. No, it's not letting me light it. Ah, uh, this is this shouldn't be this uh, difficult to do this. <laughs> what I'm thinking. Now they're taking even the torch as like a puzzle in itself. Like, how the hell do you light up the torch? Probably gonna be something stupid. I'm not even thinking. Uh, what flame lit area? There's a flame lit area everywhere. Yeah, there. People just gotta make this really uh, complicated. Mystery man carrying. Yeah, we know who that guy is. Uh, 
All right. So I'm guessing Bandana Fireboy, what's going on? Yeah, I'm getting really uh confused on this. Alright, I'm guessing the fire area that they're wanting me to go to is top right. Oh, he's following here. Oh, thanks. I appreciate it, Bandana Fire, but... Ow. He's getting more stamina. <laughs> okay, I gotta run around him. He's, he's laying me out. There we go. He's gonna make this tough. Where he's gonna follow me around all the time. What are you getting back up? No, he's just suffering. All right. From what I'm guessing, gotta be kidding me. Oh, wow. That took more energy out of me than the gun did. <laughs> it seems like he starts getting more intense every time I beat him to death. I don't think he's liking it too much. I would just run past him, but I don't want to leave her behind because if I do, then she'll be stuck in the room behind. I won't be able to take her with me. All right. I'm guessing. But the the holy flame. Ne never mind. The holy flame is what they were talking about. Um. Gotta go this way. Pretty sure at the end of this path, this is where that torch was, but that was just standing by itself. I see a bunch of factory stuff that could be like a place to dip. Holy flame, yeah. Yeah, he just hits it. He don't light it. You can't use it as a key to do anything with it. Why didn't he lighten it? This is where I got the seal, so this is the wrong way. I thought it was the right way. I'm gonna have to come back for her. She's not gonna be behind me. Well, I guess she is. Was it up here that I saw that torch all by itself?
I don't get how to light the torch. It's not really explaining that part to me. That's what I don't get. My, phone, my computer's going crazy now. Um... It says it can light it at any of the uh, holy flames. Problem is, I'm pushing every button I can. Then light it at any one of the torches with the holy flame and make haste, blah, 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 blah. Get to each well before the fire goes out or... Yeah, it's doing exactly what I thought. Maybe you can't light it unless... Unless she... Because I was thinking maybe... Um, well, that's not good. That's not good at all. Oops. Got some technical difficulties. All right, that's good. Because when it reinserted, it said that it wasn't um, recognized. All right, make sure this is on properly. I gotta get to a save area so I can go back to his apartment. That's what it's about. I'm surprised that guy's back. But yeah, I gotta go back to his apartment. And there's... Strangely, there's oil in his laundry room. Whatever. Room. Now, that's the same room where the portal is anyway, so. Once it's soaked with, uh... It says it'll last longer once it's soaked, but I don't understand whether or not... Is the tank filled with oil? You soak the end of the t torch in oil. If you light the torch now, it should burn for a long time. I don't understand how to light the torch. I've pushed the combination of buttons. It's not asking me if I want to light the torch. Like a key or something. I believe this is the easiest one, so let's, from what I'm seeing, it's saying that you can light it at any torch.
Okay, there you go. I don't know why it wouldn't let me light it before. I was trying to get it to light before. I was doing every combination I could to light it. Alright, now I know that there's a... Well, here we go. Oh, now I gotta backtrack to get her. She just gets a couple feet behind and it's like, game over. Come on, you don't have to play with them. There's five... Five items to get. Going, I'm burning up my torch time completely. It's got a leg. Alright, there should be a. Uh, come on, girl. Don't burn my torch up. Go this way to this well. He's just going to lay in time. Thought this room had a or a well in it. Maybe it's this one. Well, it doesn't matter. He's just going to shoot at me too. Doll's head. Walter's all about driving me nuts. Just gotta zigzag around him. Can't give him a clean shot. Well, if there's five pieces, there must be a path that has two wells in it. From what I'm seeing. Alright, the head's on there. Come on, girl. There you are. use a heel. I figured that'd be a well in this part of the woods. Well, that's a shame. Is there a well in this area? My flame went out. Backtracked to get her since my flame went out anyway. Where's she at? Ain't dead, is she? I must have left her way back. I don't see any like random wells out here. I was hoping maybe there would be like one of the paths of two wells in it. I didn't see a single well in this path. Oh, there's one. Guess I need to go back and soak my um torch in oil again. 
It's going to make me. Things are getting even more intense now. Seems like it's flipping. I didn't notice that up there. Can I not use it? <laughs> Maybe it's already like permanently filled with oil. I mean, permanently soaked in oil, so I don't have to keep coming back and re-soaking it. Because it's not letting me interact with it. Got two legs and a head. I just gotta find the arms. Both the arms must be down the same path. That's what I'm believing anyway. Walter over here gonna try and assassinate me. Ooh. He whipped out that chainsaw. There she is. I don't see any, um... Well, they're not going to mark the wells for me. Okay, I see maybe that there's two wells and the one path that I haven't been yet, so... On the way. legs and a head I don't think I really need her to come with me and I guess she could help a little bit to protect me if she'd catch up and not burn my torch up Is this no it's not the area it should be this area where there's two wells and there's one left arm where's she at she... I don't see her. I thought she came with me. Wow, that holy flame didn't keep this guy down. I was checking to see if I had a sort of obedience on me. No extra well there. Maybe a well in this part. This is an extra long area. I don't see no well.
Makes you want to play Deuce X the first one. Welcome in, Lagged. How you doing today? I'm hoping my torch doesn't burn out. It did. I have to back up just a little bit. Like two areas back, I believe. Always good, right, Laggart? Oh, he's not even in the room, right? Alright, got the light. I gotta find the last. There's one more well I gotta find. Got everything but one arm for this uh, doll I gotta put together. Doubt that the well, the extra well is back this way, but all I can do is just keep looking. See it over there. What about over here? Oh. Hopefully in the next room. There it is. Last well. I also miss playing Silent Hill 1 for PS1. I just, I've been playing all the Silent Hills in order. Because this is Silent Hill 4. I've, uh been beating them all uh numerical order but yeah i uh, got the whole playlist on my youtube channel i just been going right through it since uh october one two three and four i've been doing the same thing with resident evil back and forth because after i play this i plan on playing resident evil 4 i haven't played resident evil 0 and um what else uh cut veronica So those games are always fun to play. This guy's jumping back and forth in front of me. But yeah, Silent Hill 1's an awesome game. I I had a lot of fun playing Silent Hill 2, streaming that one. And now that I got all five pieces, these guys are coming everywhere. Zero is hard to get into for you, but uh, I, I completely understand that perfectly. Um, it was hard for me to get into it at first, too, because I had... I just had to get used to the uh, team-based system in it. It's rough. Having to, especially having to protect your uh, AI partner while um, you're trying to beat a, a difficult boss, it, it's kind of it's kind of hard in that game. Pretty rough. Stay here and take it. Took her a while to recover, but she's back up. Come on. Damn, she's all bloody now. She must almost be dead. <laughs> you like Dracoon City? I haven't played it too much, but it is a good game. I'll give you, I'll give you that one. I've always, I've, I played 
the hell out of Resident Evil 1, though, to the point where, um, I can basically speed run it with a knife. All right, we got them all in. You love the 164? Hell yeah. There's a sta staircase going down. Let's go. I'm sure this will take me to the cylindrical uh, prison. Water prison. There's a book here. Looks like some kind of Bible. The Descent of the Holy Mother. The 21 Sacraments. The first sign, and God said, at the time of fullness, cleanse the world with my rage. Gather forth the white oil, the black cup, and the blood of the ten sinners. Prepare for the ritual of the holy assumption. The second sign, and God said, offer the blood of the ten sinners and the white oil. Be then released from the bonds of the flesh and gain the power of heaven. Let darkness and void bring forth gloom, and gird thyself with despair for the giver of wisdom. The third sign, and God said, Return to the source through sin's temptation. Under the watchful eye of the demon, wander alone in the formless chaos. Only then will the four atonements be in alignment. The last sign, and God said, Separate from the flesh too, she who is the mother reborn, he who is the receiver of wisdom. If this be done by the mystery of the twenty-one sacraments, the mother shall be reborn, and the nation of sin shall be redeemed. Oh, yeah. Man, she is all beat up. I only left her behind once. Is there two ways? No, it's just one way. It's a round depression about 10 inches wide here. Yeah, this is where the seal goes. And God said, separate from the flesh, too. She who is the mother reborn, and he who is the final receiver of wisdom. She's starting to sound like one of them. Yeah, this is the path down to the next area. It's gonna be either four or five worlds at least. I'm only like. Oh, thank you, uh, Lager. I appreciate it. Yeah, I'm just repping for uh, Veterans Day since I was a Marine when I was in the mil military. Wow, well, she is walking a lot slower than she was. Anyway, let's see what the world changed since I beat that part. I might have to put a key or two away. Definitely gotta put the torch away. I ain't gonna need that again. At least I don't think so. The whales were the only thing I couldn't see in. I'm going to guess there's going to be another diary page since I beat that area. Alright, let's check this out. I guess not. No diary page. That mass on the wall is growing bigger.
this game really that long? <laughs> Let's see, I, yeah, I forgot to put that away. Should have definitely put that away. All right. Continuing on back in. Yeah, that's what's weird is that she can't see the, the whole every time I go into it she says that I just disappear and vanish yeah entering the fiery but oh she's dragging a bit thou must return to the wellspring of sin yeah she keeps on citing verses from their Bible instead of following me. That's yeah, definitely the, uh, hmm. It's gotta be the water prison. Yep, this is the water prison. I have a feeling this one's going to be really confusing. that all about he's just firing both oh yeah that's right she can't go down ladders don't stay and fight him please don't be stupid Gotta run through this craziness with nothing but heels on. Can't really see whether or not we're coming up on. Uh... All right, here we go. I. Yeah, I assumed that was going to happen. She doesn't want to come along. Come on, don't play with him. Never played this one. This is so different than the first two. Yeah, this is definitely way different than the um, any of the first three. Uh, um, this game, I really still trying to figure it out completely. It's kind of stuck in your own world which is your apartment room room 302 and you're trying to escape it but then you find out your neighbor Eileen right here is stuck and in, in the world too so you're trying to help her escape with you I gotta backtrack pretty much with her
Oh, no. <laughs> There's something written on the paper. Now it will look like I'm sleeping. Oh, yeah, I've read that before. What's this? That's a holy candle. I don't need that. It's so damp and gross here. Wonder if there's uh you ready to jump down a hole, girl? I wonder if she'll jump down this with me. She did not. Oh man, I had to go all the I gotta walk all the way back up there and get her. I thought maybe since that's a shame. <sighs> See, this is the exit. How the hell am I be able to bring her down here if she won't jump down the hole? I have to backtrack super hard. Didn't realize it was going to be this tough. This room, they'll take me outside. Yeah, definitely wouldn't be Silent Hill if he didn't have to backtrack. Alright, this room isn't going to take me where I want to go. I remember getting stuck here when I played it last time. Is this the first or second floor? First floor. This way will take me to the where I want to go back to. What's really going to be frustrating about her is that she can't... Uh, she can't walk. She can't jump down those holes. She can't... Climb down ladders. Oh, I already beat this thing down. Maybe it's this room I left her in. Nope. Can't remember which room I left her in. diary because I see a shadow move yeah I've already read that one from the last time I came through uh, wow they're just what respawning or what girl will it show up on this I'm not even on the right floor no wonder I'm not seeing her I didn't even know she was on the third floor oh this is going to take a while to get her down Yeah, 
So we're going to have to do some really fun walking. I don't even have the size clue to get down to the basement without taking ladders. That was the whole point to the puzzle last time. I would say about probably three quarters. I'm not really sure. I haven't uh, completed the whole game before. Yeah, you definitely have to backtrack a lot in Silent Hill games. I was trying to keep her with me so I don't get caught up to that one dude. Why is she walking back the other way? Hey, if she wants to play games, what's on her? Oh, come on. That's why she was walking back, was because of him. There we go. Just had to trigger. Welcome back, Chaos. Alright. We need to go down one more floor, I guess. Come on, don't get stuck by... Come on, why are you getting stuck by that stuff? She's just watching it. I'm tired of babysitting her. Gonna get me shot. All right, this is lowest level I can go without taking a ladder. Is she supposed to be the mother from the second? Um, no, she's just a neighbor. These characters really aren't related to any of the uh, people from the storyline in the first, second, or third uh, Silent Hills. Yeah, she definitely needs to take her high heels off. She's making this way too hard on me. Yes, yeah, it's, it's just this guy is stuck in his um, room and he's finding out why he's stuck there. Yo, MNC Couch Knight, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good night. We're working on finishing this game tonight. I believe the path to the very bottom is this way. Hey, Lager, thank you for the follow. I appreciate the support. The high hill is definitely ain't helping. He's already gimping as it is. Right. As far as I know, this is the path to go to take us out of this prison. So I've already opened up the doors that, uh, you know, the doors that lock, unlock from the other side, so I believe I'm going the right way. Because the body chute takes you to the prison. Or, I mean, the body chute takes you to the kitchen. And that's where we need to be. Feels like I'm still going down as far as I know. So this path down here should take me to the basement. I haven't found any puzzles for this like I did the other ones yet. At least anything to get in my way. acting like I'm about to attack or something. There's the basement door. 
It's a lot of walking because she can't take ladders. I wonder if this door down here will change. Because I remember seeing this door down here and last time I came here it wasn't opening, it wasn't wide enough for me. Oh, it's locked. That door wasn't wasn't supposed to be locked. Copied the water wheel room plate message into the scrapbook. I was just hoping there'd be a key. Whoa, ho. That's locked. I would say. Okay. I see what I did. We need to go one more floor up because we're in the engine room. We need to go up through the kitchen. I just went one floor down. Every Silent Hill game I've ever played except for Downpour and the one that came out after that I needed a guidebook for. I don't I don't blame me there. These riddles in this game are super, super uh, difficult. I've had to look up a few answers to um, where I needed to go during gameplay myself. It's, uh, Silent Hill is not the easiest series in the world. I need to get her, get to this, uh, next, uh, double door right here. I believe the kitchen's on the right. Yeah. Might as well. All right, this is the way, uh, Should be the way out. Help me. It's him. It's coming in. What's she talking about? Well, this was the exit the last time. <laughs> Prisoner's shirt. Prisoner's shirt. Something is written on it in wax. Maybe if you soak it in some kind of colored liquid. Okay. Maybe if we go back to... Let me check this. I was curious whether or not there was a... a laundry room but I guess we have to go back to our apartment and wash the shirt I wonder if there's a save at the other side of this didn't mean to hit her I need an exit tunnel Okay, I can climb all the way to the top. Leave her right there. She can't climb, like I said, she can't climb ladders, but I'll be right back to get her as soon as I save. I thought I could save. 
Guess I can't go up any higher than this. Never mind. Oh, there's a weapon for her. weapon upgrade just randomly. It's a leather sap. Nightstick. It does not require much force to cause damage, though it's extremely painful. I found the Eileen's weapon upgrades in every single area so far. Just happened to wander across them. Now she's got a nightstick. Yeah, there's nothing in here but bullets. So maybe I find some health or something, but it's all good. I've got to find. They're really going to make me run all the way back up to the top. That sucks. That's not cool. That's a massive backtrack, especially since I have to protect her all the time and worry about that guy that's shooting with two pistols. Gonna take forever. Ah, uh, yeah, I do like her. It's in the um, in the about uh, tab. Wasn't as far as I thought it was. I'm sure I have to go into the laundry room and use the shirt. It says it's soaked in wax, so we'll find out what it's the message it's hiding. This open. Oh, no diary. I triggered that much. It's a red scrap of paper. I'm going to summarize everything that I've learned about Walter Sullivan so far. He was born right here in room 302 of South Ashfield Heights. His parents abandoned him soon afterwards and disappeared somewhere, leaving the baby alone. He was discovered and sent to St. Jerome's Hospital. He was adopted by Wish House, an orphanage in the forest near Silent Hill that's run by the secret Silent Hill religious cult. When he was six years old, someone from the cult showed him where he was born. Since then, he started to believe that room 302 itself, in other words, this room, was his mother. Every week, he traveled from the orphanage to South Ashfield Heights, a pretty long trip for a kid his age. Sometimes he took the subway and sometimes the bus. I'm tired. My headache is already killing me. I, I'll write more tomorrow. Alright, there's got to be some... I need to... Uh... Nothing of interest. What about this? Um, okay, this is a puzzle. All right, I'm going to look this one up because the answer to what I thought it was going to be is 
Not right. Water soaked t shirt. Uh, silent. Go for. Dunk the shirt in his apartment's bathtub. Oh. That's cool. Not what I thought. And have me running around in circles trying to figure out everything in this area. Actually making a trip back to the bathroom. You soak the prisoner's shirt in the puddle of blood. You can see white letters rising to the top. My room is on the second floor and I had to drink something with black things in it. I hid the sword with the triangle handle under my bed. That guy, the fat one, took the basement key. Next time I'll stick this triangle sword into that pig and take the key. He's talking about sort of obedience. I have a sort of obedience, but let's grab it real quick. Maybe I have to. Ah, uh, yeah, this. Okay, go back there, and uh, I believe we're already on the um, probably the second floor, that or the third floor. I'm not sure, or the first or second floor. I mean, we've already got out of the basement, so we're there's that. Okay. I just got to go back up one more floor. There we go. She doesn't have a lot of reach with that weapon. I know Walter's going to be waiting for me out here. There he is. Come on, don't get bothered with him. She is. He's trying to shoot the double uh, wall. That ain't happening. Okay, second floor. One of these rooms. Talking about heaven. I wonder if this is where that boy was kept too. Hmm. We're on the right floor, we just gotta find the right room. are broken. <gasps> I don't want that. I peed in my pants. I gotta wash them so nobody finds out. Oh, I just saw a shadow. I think I saw me. don't see 
any. Yeah, I don't see any. Um, I've already explored all these rooms. That note's weird. It said second floor. I don't see anything. The bottle's filled with black powder. Okay. It's all well and good, but... Yo, Lady Dark Gaming Official, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good night. Just celebrating uh, Veterans Day in my own way, and... Trying to have finish up Silent Hill 4 finally, so we can move on to Resident Evil 4. Beating uh, both franchises in order. Yeah, I've took the whole circle around, and uh, let's look at that let's memo one more time. It's way down here. That's not it. That uh, would be more accessible. Note from Bloody Pears in her shirt. Rooms on the second floor. I had to drink something with the black things in it. Yeah. Triangle handle. Took the basement key. Next time I'll stick the triangle sword into that pig and take the key. Okay, um... I don't know exactly what they're talking about. <laughs> There's some dude I need to find so I can take his sword from him, but I'm not seeing him. I'm hoping I don't need to drop through the floors. That's what I'm thinking. I might have to go all the way back up to the top and drop through one of the floors and reorder these uh, body shoots. I'm just going to put in how to get basement key, so we don't waste too much time. That's what he's talking about, the basement key. It's on a gurney inside the operating room on the second floor. Okay, that's uh, well and good, but I'm in the I'm in the water prison, not you know the hospital. There's one there, a circular room, but you carefully defeat. Blah blah blah. Finally, seven o'clock, so then it's blah blah blah. Alright, now I think I'm getting close to it. Let this room head to the winding stair road. Go up, unlock the door. Drop off of these eyes, blah blah blah. blah. Dunk. I already did that. Dunk that. that. 
where looks like we're getting close. They're wanting to tell me everything about stuff I've already done. The left and you'll equip across two two victims again. Equip the pistol and blow above the don't they're even telling me how to fight them like I don't know how to fight them. If you go into the seven o'clock room cell It's not visible, but just examine the bed to find it. There are two mil more items in the cells, but they require getting by or killing two within each room. Pistols. Well, you should get them both. It's worth wasting four bullets to gain ten. Out of time. Eat. We knew it was only a matter of time before we go, but the Andrew should have answered so his car. Good luck. But before we can take it, we need to get him down. Andrew is, in, is much tougher than Jasper. And See, this is the problem I'm having here. They tell me one you just entered from. All right, okay, never mind. I think I've got it figured out because they're eight o'clock. Room is it's worth wasting, and the holy are all worth getting. If you're skilled, you can take the items before. The now head out of here and to the first floor again. Enter the door across the one you just entered from. All right, but yeah, this is a wild uh, explanation of what they're talking about. See, this is you can't get in there. I don't even know why that t-shirt even said to... You mm, dick. You kind of pinned me up against the wall there. the door across the one oh, I see I head out of here and head to the first floor again oh my god I took his footsteps as hers she's back there goofing off never wants to follow me there we go Yeah, I don't know what these people are talking about with these 8 o'clocks and 7 o'clocks and whatever nonsense. Everything I've done. It's not triggering no cutscenes. I don't know what they're talking about. There's the cutscene we were looking for. Victim 18.
supposed to fight him? I know I'm supposed to fight him, but where the hell is he? Dude doesn't know how to stop. There he is. Come on, it's not working. That's bull. The sword of obedience. Why was he standing over that guy's body while he was just... Oh my god, this game is terrible. You gotta be standing like right in the perfect spot just to get something to work right. Good thing I didn't have to backtrack too far. These guys, man, I tell you, he doesn't like to stop too easily. But yeah, I had him down on the ground, and what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to put a sort of obedience in him and take the key. Didn't work out. Yeah, he's just gonna run from me now. It's not working, like I said. He's not going down. I don't understand what's to keep what's keeping him up. Sort of obedience is not working. We finally got on back. Jeez, that was torture. Finally. Be careful of this part. I'm gonna die before I get to the next part. so much health before and now I just burned it all up and hear him up there uh, flopping around all these second run areas out of the way water prison and what was the one before the orphanage we had to beat the subway or at least finish the subway oh my I have no bullets, and there's an army of twins right there guarding the gate. Oh 
yeah. Right, take that down like a running back. Well, if she would uh, follow up. I need her to catch up. She's not gonna. Obviously, she's not gonna run and avoid him like I did. Come on. Come on, don't fight him. Now we're heading to, I believe, the hospital. A bloody t-shirt did say that there was a second floor room with a key on a gurney and an obedience sword and something, I don't know. Something we have to pick up in the hospital, I guess. Or maybe, no, that was something else. Sorry about that. That was from when I was reading something prior. Took me to a, a wrong answer. I should probably use that because my health is really bad. It looks like the room has calmed down a lot. Okay, never mind. Turn from below water prison. trying to enter the hole. I'm not trying to do anything else. I guess the fourth area. Second run of. Or how much Walter's going to chase us through the uh, hospital. Been showing up a lot. Loading up next area. It's a diary. I want to go back to that time. Things were so good then. The day of my birthday. The cute cat in the pet store. All those balls in the basket. Playing pool was fun too. The door of time was wide open. When I see four things, I can't help but remember that time. Decided not to follow me yet again. <laughs> that guy just appeared. Three buttons lined up vertically. Press a button. I remember. 
for this place. It looks a lot like downtown Ashfield. Basement eight. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. I remember this uh, <gasps> massive back track. Hopefully we find some heels on the way. There's one. Oh, I'm dead. I got lucky because I pushed that as soon as it popped. She's not helping at all. She's just watching me get crushed. That heel just like saved my life. I had to sacrifice my own health just to uh, keep her protected. She, she's not using that uh, nice stick very well. My leg hurts. I'm not even running. I'm walking and she's sprinting. Walking faster than she's running. Three wood. I haven't seen that the last time. They present it like it's uh, important. Cake candles here, that's weird. Col colorful candles for putting on a birthday cake. Usually when you find something weird like that, it's always going to have something to do with the, the apartment. So let's check it before we uh, get too ahead of ourselves. Wow, this apartment has gone dead silent. Did I finally get past all the nonsense? Still looks a little heavy in here. It's a red scrap of paper. Continuing from yesterday, I'm going to summarize everything that I've learned about Walter Sullivan so far. Naturally, it was a long way for a kid his age to travel, but he made the trip every week by subway or bus. Unfortunately, someone else was living in the apartment, and so he couldn't be reunited with his mother, room 302. For years, he continued to come here, almost like he was possessed, just to peek into the apartment. Eventually, the tenants began to complain and treat him badly when they saw him hanging around. Walter began to fear the tenants and see them as obstacles preventing him from seeing his mother. As the years passed and Walter matured, he began to be more and more influenced by the teachings of the cult. Furthermore, his obsession with his mother and his feelings of resentment towards the outer world became even deeper. Walter became preoccupied with one particular tract from the cult's Bible, the descent of the Holy Mother, the 21 sacraments. By the 21 sacraments, the Holy Mother shall appear in the countries of the world and shall bring salvation to the sinful ones. After Walter left Wish House, he moved to Pleasant River, a town neighboring Sound Hill. For a while, he lived the life of a normal student, but he was still filled with bitterness and resentment towards the rest of the world. Several years later, he launched his plan there, the 21 Murders. Hi. 
the hell? Hearing a kid's voice. Didn't feel like it saved it. I don't know what that noise is doing. It's coming from the box. All right, well, I guess we can continue on in. Yo, King Satan, how's it going? We're getting close. Almost to the end, I'm thinking. Almost dead, though. I need some health. Yo, Lagger. Welcome back. I looked for it. I could find the Discord link. It should just say, it should just be in my about, and um, just click on the uh, icon that just says Discord um, in the about me section. Yeah, just click on the word, the big uh, old, red old English uh, writing that says Discord, the banner itself, and it should uh, take you to the link. It's all good. You wouldn't. You're not the first one that uh got conf confused about that banner. I need to put a better uh, description about how to uh, click on it. I've seen a lot of people just put like a regular clickable uh, click here thing on there underneath their description. Whoa, this is confusing. Walking on the ceiling and all my buttons are reversed. An upside down clock. The hands aren't moving. The doorknob is rusted shut and I can't get it open. Huh. Where's mommy? I don't see any other way through this room. I'm getting confused about how to walk in here. Oh yeah. Daddy? Where's Daddy? Girl, I don't know, but I'm getting really confused. 
confused about how to do this. I'm walking upside down and everything's reversed. The only door I'm seeing that we can walk through is the one we came from. This is tripping me out. I'm hoping I can figure this out. Are you okay? I don't see anywhere else to go. Well, there's doors on that other side if I can get to them, but how the hell do you get over to that side? Because this is just going to lead me up this way. There's got to be a door I haven't seen yet. Maybe where all those ghosts are. Something I'm not seeing in here. Just messing with them hurts you too much. It's not even worth it. They don't stay down. need to find out where this one will take me because I think I skipped a double door somewhere now this is going to take me back up I've already been through all this oh I see they go up just back to the sporting uh, area Be some uh I saw a couple areas over here at the sporting goods area. It's like a door right next to the save room. Must be where I have to go. Yeah, this has to be it. Why not? You can always burn it. All right. Looking good. Um. All right. I think I figured out. Yeah, this looks familiar now. I'm good. There's that opposite side, though. Oh, no, that's the same door. Never mind. There's only one door on this side. Let's go, girl. We're all good. Things sound like they're getting really bad. Well, what's causing that? Sounds like something new. My leg. 
Girl, I'm not even running. This is a weird place for a stuffed animal. Stuffed cat with droopy ears. I'm gonna have to run circles around this guy so I can light the birthday cake. He pushed, he pushed me away from it and grabbed me. the hell? The birthday candles put him down. <gasps> um, if those doors are out. These dogs are going to kill me. Especially since she's not going to help. Death. I don't know what she's doing back there. She's just watching me get destroyed. <sighs> yeah, that's all right. We're going the right we're going the right direction though. Um that holy candle don't do crap. I don't know what the hell that's supposed to do. Just gotta get back upstairs. It's just gonna take me a few more minutes than usual because she likes to take her time. Daddy? Get killed by these uh, leeches Daddy? now. She's over there talking to herself. If I get hit once, I'll probably die. There's birthday cake and champagne here. Uh huh. I guess it was the holy candle that put that guy down. <gasps> I'm just gonna have to take my chances. Damn. I can't do anything when she's doing nothing but watching. All right, one more time. It's not helping that I can't uh, heal myself in the uh, in this world anymore. Let's go back. Are you okay? Yeah, that's all good, Chaos. 
I'll get past it this time. As long as she doesn't give me too many problems. If I'm running, she's already, uh... I don't know what she's stuck on. Yeah. I think when she gets hurt, I get hurt. That's the problem. She runs slower than I walk. I think I might. I'm not sure, to be honest. I'm hoping to find some health somewhere, because these dogs, there's a ton of them out in this uh, alleyway right here that I gotta try to get past. No! Right at my feet! There's a health drink right there. Oh my god. There was a health drink right there. I couldn't get it. The dog's like lagged to me. Problem is if I try to shoot the dogs. Well... Let's try that. I'm gonna have to probably shoot a couple dogs on the second floor. Oh, I don't have any bullets. Because I fought that one guy. That's right, I forgot about that. Forgot about the boss of the last area that took all my bullets. Yeah. Now I just got a couple more um, leeches dropped on me, so my life just went down even more. Um, like borderline dying. I uh, don't like how they just ask me if I want to pick stuff up. I was thinking maybe it was distracted dogs, the stuffed cat. But no. Oh, there's more than one dog, I guess. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Not that way. Maybe back here. I uh, got past it that time. Oh, yeah. Another dog. This one's alone, so I can actually fight it. There's another one. I can fight him now. go now we got past it don't go too fast I'm not trying to you're just slow <laughs> wow this whole direction this whole direction take the driver this whole direction was a dead end I think this whole direction was a dead end
Whatever, at least I got some health back, so I don't have to worry about that. That helps a ton. I think I got two, uh, two drivers. I'm gonna take advantage of it. A little bit on the reach. I never realized this game was this long. Look at that. There's health on here. Nice. It gave me a health drink. I wonder if it's through here. No. Not through there. Let me examine that clock. It's just going nuts. All right, guys. Um, I'm gonna call it for uh, this part of the stream. I'm gonna be back. Uh, let me get this right. I'm gonna be back for uh, retro late night in about an hour. Um, I might push it to uh, 11 o'clock Eastern time because it's Friday night. So I want to be able to stay up and play a little bit longer. I might be able to push uh, three more hours into it. So uh, it'll be between 10 and 11 o'clock Eastern Time when I come back on for Retro. So uh, y'all get a notification if you drop uh, a follow. I appreciate it so you can uh, know that when I'm getting back on. So come back and check me out. Uh, hope you all enjoyed the stream. We'll see what we'll be f playing later for Retro Late Night. But uh, I had fun and... I planned on finishing this game today, but it's a lot longer than I hoped. We'll finish it. Uh, we'll finish it either tomorrow or Monday. I'll uh, see you guys uh, later tonight, and happy Veterans Day. Later.